My name's Andy Smith. Um, I'm a Chartered Fellow of the British Computer Society. I came out of uh, Royal Holloway's Distance Learning Program with the Masters in Information Security in 2006, uh, having been one of the original students on, on the first intake of the Distance Learning Program. Um, so that in itself was quite interesting and quite a challenge. I decided to study for the degree because um, I've been working in information security for a number of years. Uh, I think coming on for 18 years now, I've been in information security in one form or another. Um, and I'd got a lot of practical experience, but I hadn't really got the, the theory to tie it all together. I looked at the different master's programs that were available, and this one really came out as one that could uh, give me that theoretical knowledge as well. Uh, there are a number of aspects of this course that were of interest. Uh, the ability to be able to pick individual modules so I could, I could do those things that interested me. Um, and because of the sort of work I was doing, um, I'd got practical experience with cryptography, but not the theoretical. So doing the course on cryptography was actually very useful. Gaining the Masters has helped to uh, bring together a lot of the practical experience I've got and give it that theoretical base so that um, and, and give me a better idea of how to actually do research and uh, find answers to questions I come across uh, in my job. Um, the dissertation I did uh, proved very relevant. Um, the project I was working on at the time uh, was looking at uh, remote authentication and use of different credentials for remote authentication. So I chose to do my dissertation actually in remote authentication of identity. And that allowed me to tie both what I was doing at work and the project that I was trying to deliver there with uh, all of the research stuff that I was doing for the dissertation. And it actually allowed me to develop a solution for the project uh, that was much better than uh, would have otherwise been. Going forwards after actually achieving the degree, it's not um, led to any specific projects that uh, I, would, I would otherwise not have done, but having that master's degree has really helped in um, making it easier to do certain aspects of projects. Um, especially the cryptography. The cryptography has proved invaluable in the project I'm currently working on, um, where we're doing network security, um, and also the stuff we did on uh, auditing and protective monitoring and intrusion detection. Uh, that's proving invaluable on the, the networks that I'm working on at the moment. There's a number of reasons for recommending the uh, course at Royal Holloway. Uh, at the time I was looking at doing a master's degree, uh, I looked at all the courses that were available, obviously, and out of, out of those courses, this was the one that offered uh, the best balance of uh, theoretical research uh, and practical experience, and also had the best reputation, so it, it's one I thoroughly recommend to anyone. Nowadays, the, I suppose the main issue that's uh, affecting information security is one that's actually been there right from the start, um, it's the human factor. It's human error, apathy, complacency, stupidity. Um, people allowing themselves to be uh, attacked using things like social engineering and psychological manipulation. People just generally doing things wrong and quite often people overreacting when something bad happens. So instead of putting in practical controls that are helpful, um, they put in controls that basically stop people doing what they need to for their job. Those people that have studied this course will get a much uh, better grounding in the sorts of issues that are affecting information security today. Uh, you get uh, a good level of understanding of the issues that have to be addressed. And one of the things that comes through in the course is that information security is a business enabler. It's there to support the business and allow the business to work properly. It's not there to stop people doing things and to get in the way. 
Um, so this course is actually very helpful in getting people to do information security properly.